Hello everybody, it is Jacob from Jacob Gundy Plays here, and today we are doing my first episode of the village, the modern village style video series. So in this episode, we will be making this miniature farm hut and one of these lampposts, but modern style. So first, we will go over to this chest that I have over here. And we will start out with some sandstone, some stone slabs, and some blocks of quartz. It might be hard to get all the blocks of quartz needed for this, so I recommend building it in creative mode. Oh, yeah. And light blue stained clay. So first, we build up one, two, three, four, five. Actually, no, just three. Okay, and then we build across two. So keep in mind right now, I'm kind of staying with like the traditional design. That's my plan for this, to stay with the traditional design, while at the same time keeping it modern. So we're gra going to grab some jungle wood planks, and place them sort of like this. Like that. We're going to grab some sandstone and build it up and over. And then cut off the top corners. This will look more modern when we are done with it. Do the same thing on the other side. While cutting off the corners as well. Then connect them all. Last time, remember, don't put the corners on. Yep, I'm doing it right. Okay, so now we're going to start on the design of the house. Well, actually, no. Okay, I am sorry about that, but now we need to build. We need to build everything one block higher. Okay, now we are done with the main part. So right here is where our door will go. And this quartz block gives it a more modern look. And then right here will be reserved for our window. We're going to put a big window on the back. Okay, now time for the moments of truth, the actual windows. So place them in, in all the spaces except this two block tall space right here. So now time to put that all back and start on the inside decoration. If you watched my first video to all this, then you know what I'm talking about because I said I'd put inside decoration. So this is going to so this is going to probably be pretty simple just um sort of a little table just to make it a little home like We're going to place this door right here and place a button on the inside and on the outside So then after we're done with that we're going to Build these things like this with a space in the middle, which will be reserved for the redstone lamps. Um, okay, then just put levers on them. You can use whatever kind of redstone mechanism you want. I'm using levers. Or you could use daylight sensors. 
So let's now take a look at our house. Slow the video, repeat the video several times or slow it down if you need it a little slower. Pause it at any time. So, yep, it stays faithful to the old design, but still makes it modernish. That doesn't mean I'm going to build all the buildings exactly like they have them in the exact same shape and size that they have them in the regular villages. So now it's time for the street lamp. Oh yeah, and I forgot to review the inside again. All it is is the tape, the, the anvil, and the spruce stairs, and the lights. So, build a pillar about one, two, three four blocks high well, actually no three and then put a daylight sensor on it switch that to day okay okay you can use levers if you want that so, you can use levers if you want it to stay on at all times, but right now I'm going to use this nightlight sensor, because in the day you don't really need as much stuff in the village. Well, as much light, I mean. And... Okay, that's pretty much it. So now you see what I'm trying to do. Now that you get the basic hint of what I am trying to do, you know that... Um, yep. So, please like, so, so please like and subscribe. Please, I need subscribers. And just try and build this on your own. Goodbye.